What's up guys? Magandang hapon. Kumusta? My eyes still looks like hell. Usually takes like two or three days. Stupid allergies. I've had this my whole life. Maybe once every six months I wake up like this. And it's not ipis guys. I really don't think it is ipis. Because yeah, even in Japan this would happen just everywhere. And I don't think cockroaches have been following me my whole life. <laughs> anyway, about to put in the work here with Coach Irwin. Boom, follow Irwin on social media, please, guys. Follow him on YouTube, uh, Coach Irwin. I'll put the link down below. Gonna put in some boxing work before heading back down to Manila with uh, with Boss Bullet. Let's go. And he got it. Twelve minutes. Okay, okay. <laughs> hey, yes, sir. Three, two, one, ten, five. We do always twelve minutes. That's true. I've been in Manila too long, guys. I forgot. It's always twelve minutes with Coach Irwin. It's not ten minutes. <sighs> Rooftop boxing. Heavy bag time. He's trying to kill me. Oh. He kills me on pads and then gives me the best massage after. It's a love hate relationship. How can I hate the guy? <laughs> The other side. Like There's a. Uh, oh. <laughs> like oh. Maybe. Just one. Oh. <laughs> awesome. Thank you, bro. The next day. Magandang hapon. What's up, guys? Kumusta? My eye is still a little swollen today, but getting better, much better than yesterday. Uh, let's talk training. Let's talk uh, bullet training and uh, go over some of your comments. So, bullet's been training hard with uh, Coach Jerry and with Coach G. Uh, next 
And we've been keeping in touch, even though I'm here in Baguio. But I'm coming down to Manila tomorrow, so training will uh, resume with uh, Bullet and uh, Coach G as soon as I come back down. Funny thing, after training with Bullet quite a few times now, I've actually come to realize that he has a solid uh, guillotine. Which makes me think about how I got involved in this whole thing uh, regarding the guillotine with Kiko and the neck crank, etc. So, it's funny looking back now, after training with Bullet a few times and seeing him try the guillotine and do the guillotine on a few people in training, um, yeah, I've come to realize that he's got a solid guillotine. Now, the question, of course, going back, is whether it was solid enough and if Kiko tapped um, and if Kiko was really <laughs> gargling and everything. I can't say. Uh, I'll never know. Only the two of them will know, but it's just funny looking back in hindsight. So going into town now to run some errands from Junking Ikansensia. I don't know if I said that right. Uh, challenging me to only speak Tagalog for a day. I really want to do this challenge, guys, and I think it would be fun, but I'm going to have to bring a dictionary or I'm going to be glued to my phone on Google Translate for the whole day because conversations are going to go so slow. But... Comment down below if you guys want to see me do this challenge. I think it'll be fun. Yo guys, shout out Paulo Miguel Hernandez and Prince TV. Thanks for tuning in. Also, just curious, are any of you guys into crypto? I got into crypto during the pandemic. Uh, comment down below if any of you guys uh, follow and are into cryptocurrency. Walking to the post office now. I got a special package. Another package, guys. Got my Japanese premium instant ramen from Japan. For all you ramen lovers, I definitely recommend these guys. Check them out. All right, guys, unboxing. Let's take a look. What's up guys, I'll close here. I'm here at City Lights having coffee with my dad. Um, comment down below. I'm going down to Manila tomorrow to train with Bullet. So, um, looking forward to the rest of this camp. Igat, God bless guys. Thanks for watching.